it's just relaxing. Like it's a it's a therapy for me. It's just it's quiet. It's out outdoors in the warm sun, and I just start burning away. Just as kids, we were playing with a magnifying glass, and uh, I just grabbed a piece of wood and just drawing or burning little pieces of art, and then I thought, well, you can make signs for people, and it just kind of grew from there. This all started when he first got hurt. We got the phone call and apparently someone had just come clean across the ice and had sent him into the boards and he went head first and broke his neck. So as then now a quadriplegic. For somebody in his condition to be able to create that is, uh, it's, just, it's, uh, it's you, you can't even describe it. You gotta see it and just be in awe. He doesn't see his limitation as a limitation, but rather as a strength. He's able to do this. So, you know, many people in his position would just do nothing, but but he totally works to his potential. Well, the challenging part is to get out there when it's warm enough. It has to be warm enough so I can sit outside. And then, of course, it can't be any clouds because if there's no sun, you can't burn. So it's either you do it right the first time or it's no good. He's so dedicated to finishing, starting something and finishing it that uh, he, uh, he'll sit in that sun for hours. You know, he's a perfectionist. The last one I did of Connor is not finished because I want him to sign it before I put the finish on. You'd think someone that got hurt playing hockey wouldn't be such a big fan, but total opposite for Norman. He's always been an Oilers fan. I just spin the board around to do the other side. I just enjoy doing it. I just, it's fun to do. Just come outside and relax and listen to my music and just continue burning and burning.